Okay. Greetings to Dr. Ida and my friends. I am group representative for group V. Okay, subject MSL 3032, Aesthetic Group B. Our topic is Islamic Arts. Okay, our group member is Nelson Bin Lois, Carol Vanessa Ali, Nor Hidayah Binti Zainal Amri, Loretta Lai, Lee Sewi, and Nitopia Laria. All right, introduction. Islamic art includes fine art produced since the 17th century by the inhabitants of Islamic territories. It covers different fields, including architecture, calligraphy, painting, and poetry. Focus on the depiction of Arabic patterns and calligraphy. Islamic art is a repetitive element in the form of geometry and does have the elements of figures based on the concept on monotemes and aims to exchange regulation. Okay, Islamic Articular. <clears throat> Okay, what is Islamic article? <clears throat> Islamic article is a combination of elements from the Persians, Romans, Turks, and Byzantine, Byzantines who left a glorious impression as example of building in Spain and in India. The periods of the development of and glory is Islamic article was in the Middle X. The development of Islamic articles is in line the, with the achievement of calligraphy, sculpture, science, and technology as well as painting. Well, no, the knowledge of building is a manifestation of the spiritual strength that life among a nation. All right. Islamic sculpture motif. <clears throat> the golden act of Islamic art began in to 715 15. Sunni Aging is the greatest Islamic contribution to the arts poetry. In general, scholars divide arts into one, namely art that has an image or form, two, art that has no image and form. Okay. <clears throat> The development of sculpture goes hand in hand with the development of other arts, especially Islamic articular. There's a building and structures uh, is usually decorated the, with carving, carving that aim to beauty and show excellence. <clears throat> History of the emergence of Islamic carving. Right. Islamic sculpture began its invasion in Arabia for Persia, Turkey, India, and the state of Malaya. The Arab were the first people to embrace Islam, and it was because then that sculpture began. The prowess uh, as carvers and carpenters painter has been proved since before the birth of the Prophet Muhammad Rasulullah Narasikin Muhammad Bani 202 2002 Sorry. Okay Veterans of Islamic Carving Arts right. The beauty of Islamic sculpture is usually based on its unique 
characters Islamic carving has different characters from the carving of the other race. It contains an aesthetic belief that reflects the skill and subtlety of the of a race. Carpet, okay, carpet art concept <clears throat> has a high value header in the composition of the composition of the way the field is decorated uh, or in coordinating the motive of the sculpture. This sculpture is often interwoven with calligraphy. Calligraphy is especially of sculpture that often found decorating Islamic building. Sculpture is also called sculpture includes anything that is sculpture or carving. Uh, Islamic carving art with verse of Quran. <clears throat> Quran is the central ridiculous text of Islam and it's widely regarded as famous literal of Arabian Arabic language. There are many works of carving art that have verse of Quran on the art of carving. The art of carving is closely related to the arts of calligraphy because Jawi writing is used on a handful of Islamic art carving has relationship with the use of verse in Al Quran Al Quran the Quran. Islamic carving material <coughs> materials. The materials for carving in Islamic art is mostly based on woodwork. Wood carving is done on the pulpits in Mimbar. The ability to carve on wood regulates height and through carving skill. The visual design of wood carving illustrates high, highly talented and skill, government, and the uh, techniques. Quranic verse uh, carved, carved using various types of materials such as wood and uh, displayed in the decoration in the mosque. Right? Usually apply in many parts of building such as door leaf, wall vendor, Ventilation panels, falling, basque board, double, double end, and king's pose. King pose. Okay, Islamic carving technique. <clears throat> there is multi, multi types of technique in carving, such as fish carving, chip carving, and relief carving. Fish carving comes from a piece of wood or some boats drill with drill saw to make translucent flower shape or patterns. For chip carving, this technique is mainly used in carve verse of a verse of Quran. For relief carving technique is a sculptural form in which figure a uh, curve in a flat panel of wood. All right. Conclusion. The main objective of this paper has been to emphasize the uniqueness of Islamic art, defined by religious belief and cultural beliefs, prohibiting to the depiction of living creatures including humans. The other most important features is the absence of regular representation. Right. Okay. That's all for our presentation. Thank you.